Hey guys, what's up? Andy V here with another pomade review. Today I'm going to be doing a review on one of my favorite pomades. It's actually a water-based pomade. I know I said that I, I'm more of a petroleum kind of guy, but I want to be fair to everybody when I do my reviews. So I basically want, you know, I want to do videos for all different kinds of pomades, which includes water-based pomades. So here we have it. One of my favorite kind of pomades is the uh, Chest Flores Molding Pomade. This stuff, super cheap guys. You can get this off Amazon for like, I think like $13 for three for three tubs of this. Six ounces in each tub, I believe. Yeah, yeah, you get six ounces, which is a lot more, more pomades and you get three for 13 bucks. I mean, you get a tub of Layrite for like 15 bucks online. It's just, so for those of you looking for a good bargain on water pomade, Trust Floor is definitely, definitely one of the best ones out there. And the smell is just, it's, it's got that classic Trust Floor smell, so definitely, definitely a plus. So let's get into it. So I got nothing in my hair since I last degreased it. I mean, absolutely no kind of grease. And I just had black and black and white on yesterday. So I'm going to start off with uh, actually using Trust Flores, um, the uh, hair tonic. So, I mean, the main ingredient is just mineral oil and fragrance. So the reason why I use the hair tonic is really for the sheen. So I can get a little bit of sheen from the, from, from the pomade. And it helps it, like, not become as hard in your hair. So you're not like a cement head. So a little bit more pliable in the hair. So I, I don't take that much, I take maybe like a dime size amount. And I just put it in my hair. Make sure you get it all in there, all in the roots. Cause this is what's gonna help give it that sheen and help not really harden your hair throughout the day. So I might put a little bit more actually. Just rub it through the hair. Yeah, I really, I really love this pomade. This is like, if I were to use a water-based pomade every single day, it'd probably be Trust Flores, just because it's so cheap and it's like one of those classic smells, and you can't really go wrong with that. Alright, my towel. So I usually take like one finger scoop to start off with. I'll go ahead and put that in my hair. Remember guys, you really want to coat this stuff in your hair. Don't just put it on top and coat the top. Otherwise, you're not really going to get any hold out of this whatsoever. You really want to get in there. I usually put like, I don't know, two to three scoops. Of pomade in my hair. I mean, I don't even have that long of hair, but I always want to make sure that I get it evenly coated. So I'm gonna put another scoop in there. So yeah, I mean, the hair tonic. You can go out to Walmart and get it for like I mean, it looks like three fifty to four dollars for the Trust Flores hair tonic and it really helps bring that sheen to your hair because you know water pomades don't really bring you a lot of sheen and like what's awesome is that they're both the same exact smell so your hair is going to smell even more awesome throughout the day. <laughs> right. That looks pretty good. So usually I'm just going to take uh, my comb. I got a, I got a, um, narrow tooth and white tooth part to it. I'm going to use the white tooth part just to lay down the hair. So if you see hairs like you get like random strands of hair sticking up that probably means that you didn't really put a lot or you didn't put much at all so you gotta put you gotta keep putting more into all your all those strands laid down so as you can see, let me see, you get, I don't know if I get like random strands of hair 
sitting up, so it's not that bad. I'll just put maybe another another little coat on top. There you go. I mean, this uh, you know, as you put it in your hair and it starts to harden a little bit, the hold gets better. And you could probably do higher, a little bit of higher pumps or whatever style you're trying to do. I mean, for me, I don't. It's I don't do pumps all the time. I do them sometimes. Mostly, I just rock a side part and a contour. There you go. It's looking pretty good. So you can see I pretty much got it all coated in there. Looks pretty good. I don't really have any strands sticking out. So I'm going to go ahead and take the white two parts of my, uh, my comb again. I'm going to look for my part. For me, my part happens to be on my right side, which is kind of weird because not a lot of people have parts on the right side of the head. And I kind of have a feeling of where my cowlick is, so I kind of know where the part you guys kind of have to practice and Too bad. That's it. There you go. You guys are gonna have to kind of practice to get a feeling of where your part is. So there we go. So. So like I said, I just draw my line with the white tooth comb and then I pick a line and push it down. Right, so that you can see, I'm starting to get my part. I'm gonna comb it to the other side. So I know, I know a lot of guys have trouble when they do the parts because they don't really know how to do a part. Just pretty much follow what I told you to do and it's pretty easy. I mean, I always get complimented on my part. I mean, as you can see right there, I mean, that's a pretty clean part. It's pretty straight. Goes all the way to my cowlick. So there you have it. So then what I like to do is I'd like to take my other comb, which is a little bit narrow, but not too narrow because I like lines in my hair whenever I do my hair just to get that cleaner look. I'm gonna go ahead and recomb through to the side. As you can see right there. And I'm gonna go ahead and start doing my contour. So it's already starting to harden up. As you guys can see, let me see. Sometimes they get a little bit more difficult as soon as water pump you start hardening up. It was a little bit more difficult to get the style going. But I mean for you guys that want to do higher styles, this is definitely doing justice. I mean, when it starts to harden up, you can pretty much shape it however you want. So so, there you have it. That's how I do my hair in the morning. Still gotta fix this part when I get off camera, but I don't want to make the video too long. So that's pretty much how I do my hair. So you have it, guys. Um, Trish Flores again. One of my favorite pommies to use for water base. 
Um, really have nothing bad to say about this moment, guys. So check it out.